Hey guys, uh, it's Missy with I Dream of Wigs. This is just going to be a real quick, and I do mean quick. Um, this is Aesthetica's Reeves in the color um, Icy Shadow. A wig sister actually sent this to me wanting to do a trade for my John Renault Mariah. And since I have many of Mariah, I thought, what the heck? We'll go ahead and do this so that I can do a quick review on this. Wow! This color, Icy Shadow, when I first looked at it in the stock photos, without reading any description at all, I thought that it was a salt and pepper. It's not. This underneath in the rooting is actually a... Can you see that? That's actually a uh, golden brown. So this color, wow. I didn't think that I would like myself in these white platinum colors, but whew, I, I don't know. I, I put this on my head and I instantly felt like I was a rock star or at least a groupie, you know? So most of us know about Reeves. Um, I've done reviews on Reeves before. I don't really want to uh, focus too much on the actual style, uh, but I will tell you a little bit. This is a basic cap um, of Aestheticus, and it fits me always a little bit large. Now, this is loaded with permatees up on the top, all around the side, and the back at the nape. So if you are not a Permatees lover, Reeves is probably not for you. But this color, oh my gosh. I, like I said, I just feel like a rock star groupie. This is something that I would so totally wear to my concerts. Um, just spray that like we used to back in the old days with our aquanet and i would get this as big as i possibly could all over i like that it's got this little bit of bang here to cover that basic cap so this color icy shadow um, this combines natural and cool tones for an overall rooted ashy silver blonde. Now, I'm not seeing any blonde, but I am seeing the, you know, wow. So, it's an ice blonde that's dusted with soft sand and golden brown roots and golden brown underneath. This is from their Smokehouse Color Collection. And, Wow. I'm going to have to uh, get some of these. Since this was from a wig sister, um, I can't really, you know, talk about TL wigs a whole lot, but I am going to go ahead and drop the link where you can buy this one. I'm going to put a little bit of sea salt spray there. If you would like to purchase this from TL wigs, Reeves has always been one of my favorites. And one of the reasons is because it's just so simple to just take out of the box and throw on. I mean, you don't have to do all of this, but usually I've had to do at least a little bit of something up here because of the amount of permatees. So you can either smush that all down or you can really get in there like I do and swirl that all up and like I said, spray your spray, girl. If you like big hair, do it. You know, what's to be afraid? Nothing. Just do it and wear your hair as you want. Let's do a spin. This is amazing color. I don't know if you're seeing the underneath. I actually, after I knew that I was getting this, I saw uh, Denise Sheets, Hey Wig Sister, most of you probably know her, um, do a review on this, and she had it in an updo, and oh my gosh, I was thinking, yeah, I've got to do that. So the specs on this one really quick, um, this front bang part that sweeps to the side is six and a half. The sides, because it's got layering, is nine inches. 
The crown is 12. The nape underneath is 11 and a half. This is overall about 16 inches and it weighs 4.9 ounces, but I am telling you, it feels so lightweight on your head. So what do y'all think of me in this wild color? I like this. My husband won't, but I like this. This may be part of my um, vacation hair collection that I'm working on. See, I just, I'm always doing this because I like to get it bigger and bigger and bigger. And that was the uh, first talk with my friend was, you know, she wanted to send me this and me style it for her and send it back. And I at first told her, you know, yeah, I can do that, but I'm not promising that once it gets back to you, it's going to still have, you know, the same style that I have done to it because packing it back in its hairnet and the box is going to obviously smush that down. So I told her instead what I would do is just tell her how I style it. And I think I pretty much just showed you that. Just get in there and swirl that up. Take your wide tooth comb, you know, break these ringlet curls up. And if you want it big like I do, spray it, spray it out. I can't, I need to spray it out there and take my hair dryer and just leave it. So this summer uh, rock concert series that are coming up, these are always the wigs that I like to wear because they are budget friendly. And if something happens to them, you don't have to worry about spending and losing a whole lot of money. I know that sounds a little bit crazy, but you know, concerts, you know, things happen. So, <laughs> um, I'm going to take this off and try and put it up like Denise did and see how it looks and see if I can get that look. And then I will be back. Okay, so I'm not the best at this, but just really, really quick, I went into uh, my bathroom and just pulled the front back and then the bottom. So it's it's not the best, but it'll give you an idea of how cool it looks underneath. Oh my gosh, isn't that awesome? I think I really like this. And even if you're a you know, just half up. I'm gonna get stuck. You could always just pull, you know, some back. So overall, yes, I can see why they would call this, uh, icy shadow and part of their smokehouse collection it's because you look like a smoke show when you wear this color and i'm just getting her looking bad now <laughs> let's see what she does with a good head shake and because aesthetica is usually a little bit large on me i have to hold hold my hand there to kind of keep it. So up here you can see this uh, golden brown rooting. It's really, really unique color. I really like that. If it wasn't raining today, I would love to get this one outside and see what that looks like. All right, guys, that's about all I've got. I'm going to actually be doing a full review uh, comparison on this and John Renault's Mariah that she got. So we'll see you later, alligator.